Right. Oh, I'm supposed to check this. No doubt. That's what happens when you take a week off. I'm doing it here. Welcome to those words where we believe if done properly, a low carb lifestyle is not only healthy, but it is sustainable long term and not at all restrictive. So today we're going to be making three types of wings. I did a garlic parmesan wing sauce in the past, one of my first videos on this channel, well, probably like two months in. What we're doing today is going to be a soy garlic wing, a sweet chili wing, and a lemon pepper wing. The oven's already at 425, so I believe we can get started, but I'm going to tell the process at first because that's what I usually do. So for the soy garlic, this is sesame oil. I'm going to crush some garlic cloves, cook them at a kind of low heat because I don't want to fry them. I'm going to grate some ginger, cook that up as well. Add in the soy sauce and let that kind of reduce. This is just like a garnish for later. That's not actually going to go into it. For the sweet chili, this is chili garlic sauce. This is chili oil. This Because when I make wings, it's usually battered in some butter or some oil before putting it in, in the oven. So instead of using avocado or butter, I'm going to be using this one. I have 20 wings, five, five, and five, and just leave five plain. How we're doing the sauce is gonna be boil some water, add in the sugar replacement, then let that kind of reduce. Add in the chili garlic sauce, add in some rice vinegar into that. And then for the lemon pepper, it's pretty simple. Just gonna melt some butter, then lemon zest and lemon juice, and then toss it with the lemon pepper. This is bought. Something's wrong with this stove. It's not boiling too quick. I think I'm gonna put a cup to boil. This is for the sugar. We're gonna set up our wings first. So do this. Hopefully they fit in this bowl. Do they? What are we doing here? Do I want this or not? It usually has season with this hand. Now, put you in here. I already patted these wings dry. Oh, what I did want to do was snip. What I do want to do is cut this down the seam. I just want to pop it, up the socket, and then the cartilage down here. Yeah, you don't need to do it for this, or I can't do it for this, so I won't do it for this. But the middle one, I do want to do it. I'm going to show it just a few times and then skip forward. So just pretty much getting it down there and then pretty much popping it out. Why? I'm not entirely sure, but I've been doing this a while and I know it. it's a lot easier later on. Stay straight. People have OCD. The only reason is because if, if I don't cut this, the skin tightens up and then it doesn't like starts moving around. So now we have that. Because there's so many different flavors, I'm just going to use a very common base. Salt, black pepper, garlic powder, and onion powder. And this I'm going to put a tablespoon of baking powder. Tablespoon? Teaspoon. Yeah, that's too much. Teaspoon. Yeah, that's about right. Alright, and now... So a lot of times when I season, I just lay it out and season both sides. Yeah, everything looks pretty covered. Maybe there's a better way. But all this is going to be seasoned as well, so this part does not matter as much. But now, I have to lay these out on a rack. So, oh, you're still open here, Rogic. Go away. That's one. See, I wish I had another one that size. Okay. So right now this is just going to go to the side for a little bit. Now we can start our sauces. This is done, right? Let's just think about it. Prepping this is next, cool. I want to crush the garlic and grate the ginger. You don't really need to see me do any of this. Now, are you supposed to keep this? Right, I need about an inch and I don't want that. So, now I don't mind this. I just don't know if you're supposed to or not. So what I'm going to do is treat it like a pineapple and just do that with it. So about an inch of ginger. Is that a measurement nowadays? It's the best view for you. Like that. I'm gonna just do a whole bunch of different views. So it's gonna be an inch minus what I can't hold and do this with. That's as, as much as I can get. So that's for that. That's all the prep that we need over here. So you can move over there. That's the garlic is gonna be at a lower temperature. So what we want is sesame oil. Seems good. Let's do this. Super fragrant. So that's sticking. I'm gonna lower the heat and put some more oil. The point of this is kind of to infuse the oil. It's not to really cook all this. 
I'm gonna start with the wings. I think I should have already done that, but don't blame me. So, like I said, some are gonna have some butter, some of them will not. So, chili oil, brush or toss. You're dirty. So, like I said, it's five each. So, this one, we're going to toss in some chili oil, about like a, just a tablespoon. How are you cooking like this? My stove has been ridiculous. My bad. We're gonna do a quarter cup, because I don't know why that wants to go crazy right now. Quarter cup of soy sauce in here. And about half a cup of water. All right, and now I'm just like kind of taking all this stuff off the bottom. So I want some butter in here to melt. There's absolutely something wrong, because none of these are consistent. Because this should be boiling by now. Quarter cup of swear in there. So what is next? You. For this, because I don't want to keep burning things, I'm just going to brush it. So one, two, three, four, five. We're going to get butter. So what are the plain ones going to get? Right, because the plain ones do need to get something if they just get butter. And what do the soy garlic ones get? I have no idea. Then over here, I'll make sure you're stirring this one. Stirring this one. Okay, so these go in. There's nothing in you. Just gonna use the same brush because that doesn't really matter. Now this goes in. Now, now we kind of just want this to thicken because I don't think there's anything else that goes in there. So that's too much water for my needs. So this over here is lemon pepper. What we're doing is in a tablespoon at a time, going to mix. Oh, this is annoying, isn't it? So that was pretty much half a stick of butter. Over here, how are we doing? This is not even, yeah, this is a problem. Okay, where are we at? What's next? Lemon. Okay, so the juice of half a lemon. I should zest this first, shouldn't I? Roll it for the juices. And this goes over here. Oh, don't separate on me. I'm doing this for the seeds. I think the seed made it through. Are you a seed? I think we're good here to start with everything else. And you, you're starting to glaze up real nice. So hopefully the flavor is there. I think that's really good. So, chili. I'm gonna start here. A tablespoon of Chili garlic paste, tablespoon of rice wine, well, rice vinegar. I think this is gonna be very hot. I'm kind of scared. Spice is immediate. It is a hint of sweetness, but it is there. Yeah, so these are, oh, that's for people who like spicy. This is pretty much good and done. You see, this is where we want. That's the kind of glaze that we want. Right now, we have 30 minutes left. So let's do the lemon pepper. Put everything down to low so nothing is like burning. I think it's a tablespoon of this. All right, so this is our sauce here. Our less of a sauce. And then over here, I think it's all good. So I'm gonna shut it down because we have some time. And when I come back, hopefully those wings are ready. Okay. So real quick, I just wanted to show you. This one crystallized while I was there. So I'm gonna just reheat these a little bit while I deal with the wings. And just gonna go for about like five minutes. And we're gonna set up here. I have all the bowls that I own. Toss it in some sauce. All right, that's how it looks. I just wanna try one of the chili garlic ones to see if it actually tastes like anything. Not really. 
I, like, I know most people like their like these crispy, but I kind of don't. This one's a little bit closer to crispy. But let me put you back there, because that is soy garlic. And what I'm going to start with is, it looks ready, who wants to go? Lemon. So reheating this kind of, did some damage to it. And yes, separated. Are you? Mm -hmm. It's unfortunate. Correct, one, two, three, four. These are the five. This is. This is going to be a black one. Yeah, it's upsetting. It's still going to have the flavor. It's just. The other one was thick and it wasn't greasy. Don't live the life I live. But yeah, so I'm actually going to set up right here. Everything is going to go on this board. Just put some little lemon zest on top. These are black wings. Okay, so on camera, I'm going to try these. And I'm going to take a picture of those. So this is the hottest one. I'm going to start with lemon pepper. I mean, lemon pepper wet, right? If you watch Atlanta, this is wet. Well, the lemon is there. And I mean, the pepper you don't really taste. I guess this is just about the lemon part, but that's amazing. Now we go to this one. Have I been looking at you? That is great. Just, I didn't know they would come out like black, but that's really good. And this one, I am kind of scared of. That's why I left it for last. I am usually a honey barbecue kind of person and a mild kind of person, not a hot. Cause you get the sweet right away, and then actually no, the hot is not there. It's not that bad. I mean, of course you feel it, but I've had hot sauces where you put it on your lip and you can't breathe anymore. I just want to sprinkle on some sesame seeds. So I'm just gonna do very little. And over here, sprinkle just a little bit of red pepper. And that is about it. So let me get this out of the way. This is very dirty, so I'm gonna put you over there. How do we end this? I... Uh, so I'm a little upset because I didn't have backup audio today and I did not turn this back on. Damn. I did a lot of this off that audio. So if it sounds bad, I'm sorry. It was just that last take that was bad. with my little napkin? Um, but anyway, I mean, thanks for watching. I guess I can do this little part. What you just saw, you know what you just saw. This was lemon pepper wings, this was soy garlic, and this was sweet chili. If you just want this short inversion of just the recipe, those will be linked down below. Watch some of my other recipe videos or some of my other meal plan videos or some of my other keto tip videos. Those are all be somewhere in this channel. If you do like this channel, hit that subscribe button. If you like this kind of video, hit that like button. If you are interested in learning about more about how a low carb lifestyle can work for you and your long-term weight loss and maintenance goals, yeah, I already said it. So just subscribe, like, hit the bell, and I will see you in the next one.